Our efforts here are to make sure that we break down those barriers to make sure that college is attainable for everyone. Providing the light forward is both the mission and the namesake for a local nonprofit helping low income first generation students. Wahoopa Education Services has been around since the early 70s. And ABC 10 News reporter Ryan Hill explains how a nonprofit's roots have grown from helping our county's indigenous population to much more as we celebrate Native American History Month. Finding out what your friends did over summer can create a spark for different things. It just caught my attention looking at what they did over summer while I pretty much just didn't do anything. For Eduardo Ruiz, 15 years ago, that moment igniting a light towards resources to help with going to college. So I asked information, asked what it is about, how did I get in it, and that's how I got connected into Wahoopa Upper Bound. It's a nonprofit organization fully funded through the Department of Ed. Mia Bonafilia Vargas is the program director for Wahoopa Upward Bound, one of the programs of Wahoopa Educational Services. We are funded through TRIO, so TRIO's roots was actually built to help our indigenous population in San Diego obtain higher education and a pathway to that. The name of the nonprofit also embodying that mission. We decided to name it Wahoopa because it means enlightenment in the Lakota Sioux language. So it's kind of an homage to give back to that community. The roots of Wahoopa, which has been around since 1973, have grown, touching the lives of and helping low income first generation students of all communities free of charge. But it's always been my dream to further my education. I just didn't know how to until I came across this program. Bonafilia Vargas tells me they provide academic counseling, tutoring options, community service, and more for students like Ruiz. We've been able to help students achieve anything from scholarships to helping them provide a further pathway into what they want to do for their career. We're not just providing them a service that's going to be in the moment. We're also giving them the ability to grow their generational wealth. Ruiz, who still wants to pursue a career in the medical field, is helping those in his old shoes with the group that put him on a brighter path. Helping them pretty much navigate the whole process from A to Z to even pretty much past that has been very rewarding for me. Ryan Hill, ABC 10 News. Now the ABC.